almost like I'm about to, to cry now, to be honest. Hello guys, you know what? I am so happy now because I just spoke to my neurologist and we are going to ditch this medication, Diamox. I seriously don't know what to say because uh, I'm just so happy. Finally, some positive news about this horrendous disease. Seriously, it is so nice to be off this horrifying medication, Diamox, and uh, I will continue to do some vlogging about my disease and I will um, continue to be monitored by my eye doctors and by my neurologist. We are going to have a follow-up appointment with, with my neurologist in probably a couple of weeks and a follow-up appointment with my eye doctors in a couple of weeks. My pressure within my head has come down enough so we can ditch this medication. If you have no experience of Diamox, I can tell you this, it's an effective medication because it really does what it is supposed to do, but man, the side effects are horrendous. We're talking about tingling in your hands, uh, tingling in your feet and legs and all kinds of side effects and you get tired of it also you can have headaches just ugh. it's not a nice medication and as I said it's so nice to finally get some positive news about this disease it's such a relief for me at the moment. If you have watched my earlier vlogs from about a month ago or a couple of weeks ago, I mentioned that I have started to experience some um, switching in my legs, muscle switching. And I mentioned that to my neurologist and he told me that uh, it is possible that it is uh, a side effect of the, the Diamox because I have other medications also for my uh, depression and for my sleep and they don't know that much about um, Diamox. So it is possible that that is an interaction with my other medication and that can cause the twitching of my muscles in my legs. And uh, he's not completely sure about it, but we are going to try to be off the medication. If, and if something happens, if I get like weak legs or if the twitching moves to another part of my body, then I need to contact him again. I am not too worried about this at this moment. But, um, I thought I at least should mention it to him. I have had so many bad news the last couple of years with the stress syndrome and this IIH. And it's been a real tough journey for me. So it's so nice that to hear some positive news. But uh, I still know that uh, I will probably um, be back on Diamox in the future sometime. I don't know, but uh, that's highly likely. But I am still so so afraid that that pressure is going to go up within my head and um, cause eye problems again and even blindness. That's that's a real fear that I have. If you have IIH, you probably 
know what I'm talking about because that fear is very, very real. You know, this is such a big news for me. This is the best news that I had for uh, so many years because uh, this disease affects my personal life. It affects my life at work and yeah. It's just an incredible feeling right now, and uh, I feel completely drained, but in a positive way. I always feel emotionally drained after my doctor's visit because it puts such a it puts such a strain on me, and it's like you go to your doctor, and you know you have a chronic disease that can be quite serious. And you don't know if the results are going to be bad or better. And you have those appointments, like for me in the beginning of IH, every week. And now it's like every, not, not every month, but quite often still. And you never know if it's going to be a good result or a bad result. And this time it was not even a good result. It was a super 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 good result so if you do have IIH or an another difficult chronic disease keep on pushing because uh, you will reach your final goal even, even if it's difficult I know it's difficult but uh, you can do it and if you like this video, a sub to my channel would be amazing. Leave a comment, like the video, because I really want to spread the story to other people. And uh, it really helps me spreading my knowledge about this disease also. And I think everybody can benefit from that. And uh, with that said, thank you and bye. See you in the next one.